Hello everyone and welcome to BitBurner video 2. So I was offline for 9 hours, hours and 11 minutes as you see. It's the next day, morning. I decided to see what's going on. So my script has generated 3, almost 400,000. And my hacknet was a generate almost 3 million. And no reputation gained. All right, overview. 27 hacks. So, actually, yesterday in the bed I was thinking about a bit, like, how much money could mean here in this game. Like, how to say it? Like, what's the inflation here? What's the value of money? Because it's like 27, 7 year. It could be anything. I have like thousands, but maybe it's like a couple of cents. Similar like in Russia. With trouble. So, my idea was like, when I hugged the third server, they had 3 million inside. That web page or whatever. So basically, it's a lot of money. There is no way that some little shop, whatever he trades, probably something like one person running the business or something, because it's the first shops I, first shops in the levels, you know, like very beginning of the game. So they have no protection or anything. So three million should be how much worth? It's definitely not three million in this money, in this time. It's definitely not three hundred thousand, and thirty thousand is also too much. So it could be like three thousand. I kind of can imagine that little business could have three thousand. Three hundred would be not enough, I think, because it's more like a one person bank account. You could find 300 inside. So business account 3000 seems reasonable. So from now on, all the money I will assume I must divide by 1000 to get values close to these days. So let's say they say me I earn 400,000. In reality, I earn 4000. Does it make sense? I mean, uh, 400, not 4,000. Yeah, and let's say I have a 3 million, that's mean 3,000. So everything is divided by 1,000 to get decent values. It seems too much anyway, right now when I think about it. Because you see I earned like 3,000 in a night. That's pretty awesome business, if this is real. If this would be reality. Seems too much. But anyway, we'll run with this and see how rich we get. Basically, I would not even look for a job anymore. It's the perfect. I could just leave it like this. 3,000 every day. Awesome. Okay, let's turn off. Message received from unknown sender. Alright. Story is beginning. I know you can see it. I know you're searching for it. It's why you spend night after night at your computer. No, I didn't. Looks like a Matrix beginning. It's real, I've seen it, and I can help you find it. But not right now. You're not ready yet. Use this program to track your progress. The Flight XE program was added to your computer. Jumper. This message was sent as... J0 MSG onto your computer. I wonder why they said this. Maybe I can read it later. Like open J0 MSG. I will remember this, I think, because J is for jumper and zero is the first message. It starts with zero. Ah, so he is a computer, not a person. Because he hounds not from one but from zero. Ah. All right, enough joking around. So, I don't think I want to anything upgrade yet. We are, we have a lot of money, 3.5 million. And in this 
and today's currency would be 3.5 thousand. So I think I'm gonna try tutorials and learn everything little by little. Maybe I will need this money for some new activities. I don't know yet, like create program. But I will do it later. First we go tutorial and get started. Oh, no, 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 no. This is no good. All right. Okay, we don't want to do that. I wonder if everything is like that. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't want to read on the web page. Maybe la later myself when I'm not recording because it's not fun. So, okay, let's create program. Create program. This page displays any programs that you are able to create. Writing the code for a program takes time, which can vary, which can vary based on, your, on how complex the program is. If you are working on creating a program, you can cancel at any time, your progress will be saved, and you can continue later. If you are working on creating a program, you can cancel any time. Oh yeah, okay. So, Autolink Exe. This program allows you to directly connect to other servers through the scan analyze command. I don't see the purpose of this. I, I guess it's like I can make script that automatically connects and analyzes, so I don't need to look for servers myself. Like every time new server appears, it just connects. Maybe. I'm not gonna create it for now, because it seems a bit too complex. I see there are many things that require slight 19 hacking level is the closest. So what I have? Servers own 0 or 25. No, don't know. Hacking 31 done. Yeah, I don't even see where is my hacking level or things like that. Time play 10 hours. So it says total time, not play time, even offlines. Well, I don't know. It's not my level 31. It just hacks performed. And I don't see where the hacking level shows. Maybe it is hacking level. 31. But in that case, I should be able to create these. But it says like it's locked. Also, it could be that you make first and then you can make other one. In that case, I would have to make it. Oh, nuke. This virus is used to gain root access to, to a machine if enough parts are opened. Ports are opened. Yeah. Character hacking milestones. Milestones don't reward you for completing them. They are here to guide you if you are lost. They will reset when you install augmentations. Completing flight exe. Gain root access on CSAC. Options Auto text script exit time. I don't understand any of this terminal capacity. What the hell? Is this on or off? Ah, suppress. So they are all. Oh, I hate when, when games does this. So it's not suppressed, so they are on. <laughs> disable, disable, disable. I will leave everything as it is. Use Gib instead of JB. Why would anyone do that? What is this? Remote API. 
Okay, I'm not going to do that now. Okay, this is too complicated. Let's check achievements for a moment. Should we look at city? Last time we didn't. <sighs> okay, maybe I should better check terminal. So, how it was? No, script. Active script. So, so my scripts is not active? Oh, there are. Okay, okay, okay. Noodles, food stuff, and Sigma cosmetics. Uh, I remember they said before that money runs out. So maybe we should check that. So how did we scan? Just scan? Probably not. Oh, it did work. Noodles. Connect noodles. Shit. Connected. So now we do analysis. How do you write it? Analyze? No. Damn it. Oh yeah, all right. Noodle bar, blah, blah, blah. Total money available on server. 52k. So there is still a lot of money left. If they have yet money, other ones have as well. So we should not worry about that for now. Uh, should we connect to other one? How was the the more complex scan. Scan Anna. Damn. Anna lies. Oh, okay. Oh, but here yeah, it shows like home. It's my computer. I get, I guess. Yes. All right. So we need to go home. And then we need scan analyze. Okay, now we see everything. We have this, this, and this. We might try Joe's guns. I think you can run nuke straight away. Two million, pretty cool. Fifty one second for hacking. This is not fifty one second. This loading. It's not even thirty seconds, probably like fifteen. Okay, so we're gonna use this one as well. Joe's guns. 
So we go home. Home. Nano. Joe Gantz. JS. Uh, I wish I could see all of them. Yeah, I don't remember how you do it. Oh, they don't even show me code anymore. Those bastards. I will have to come up with it myself. I'm not going to be able to do it. So how you do it? Damn it. Okay, we need to open. Nano noodles. Yes. All right. Came up with the right idea. Maybe I should take my time to try to understand this. Like first line, I don't need it. While true. This is simply loop statement. Await ns.hack noodles. I don't know what ns means. Maybe just a command. Go to definition. Peak. Peak definition. Oops. No, no, I changed my mind. Whatever. I hope my RAM is enough for this. Save. Terminal. So, and what was uh, checking out, it, does it work uh, for logs? How it was status? No. Maybe I should read a bit internet. Not going to be very fun for you, though. So, we already had this. All right, doesn't matter. So, getting started guide for beginning programmers. Note, the sc script and strategies given in this guide are necessarily optimal. They're just meant to introduce you to the game and help you to get started. A lot of reading. Should we just skip it? Hack, grow, weekend, brought nuke. Okay, this is complicated. It looks complicated without reading. Now I have a dilemma, should I read it on my own, or should I film it, record it? Not sure if, it's, if it is interesting for anyone, but maybe if you are like learning as well, you would like to see how other person learns. Who knows? Maybe I should read at least introduction. This is an introductory guide to getting started with BitBurner. It's not meant to be a comprehensive guide for the entire game, only the early stages. If you are confused or overwhelmed by the game, especially the programming and scripting aspect, this guide is perfect for you. Note, this guide is tailored towards those with 
minimal programming experience. Introduction Bit Bitburner is cyberpunk themed incremental RPG. The player progresses by raising the stats, earning money and climbing the corporate ladder. Corporate ladder? I, I want only hack. I don't want to become a businessman. Eventually, after reaching certain criteria, the player will begin receiving invitations from factions. Joining these factions and working for them will unlock augmentations. Purchasing and installing augmentations provide persistent upgrades and are necessary for progressing in the game. The game has a minimal story quest line that can... Oh, I don't like minimal storyline. Follow to reach the end of the game. Since this guide is only about getting started with Bitburner, it will not cover the entire quest line. Well, very good. I don't want spoilers. First step. I'm going to assume you follow the introductory tutorial when you first begin the game. In this introductory tutorial, you create the script called Noodles.js. I already have it. And run it on the Noodles server. Right now, well, kill this script. These are two ways to do this. Wait a minute. I'm going to assume you follow the introductory tutorial when you first begin the game. In this introductory tutorial, you create a script and run it on the Noodle server. So basically, right now I'm not running on the server. It's like I'm running on my computer. So they want me to stop whatever I'm doing at the moment. I want to see a status. Forget how to do it. Should we try to go somewhere? I already said it before. Okay, let's just follow. This is the probably last. Because it goes like around and... 78. So 1, 2, 3, 4. This is the f closest address. City Hall. Sector 12, City Hall. A businessman is yelling at the clerk. You should come back later. Oh. Iron Gym? Iron Gym. Train strength, train defense, dexterity and agility. This is how much money it costs. Uh, 120,000 a second? Mm, that seems kind of a lot. Even with my like reduction in thousand everything. That means 120 bucks a second. That's too much. Way too much. It's like even message received from unknown sender. Soon you will be contacted by hacking group known as CyberSec. They can help you with your search. What search? You should join them. Garner their f favor and exploit them for their augmentations. But do not trust them. They are not what they seem. No one is. Jumper. This message was saved as J1 MSG onto your computer. Okay, let's try this. Open J0 MSG. Oops. Open... No, ls. Hacker starting handbook? Lit? Oh, this is cool. I'm not gonna read it now, because I am already doing something on the 
free. We are almost finished. We still could hack up probably one more thing. One more server. Yeah, I don't remember how to check progress of those scripts. Like log. Log. Okay, 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 I remember something. Help. Yeah. Analyze, backdoor, buy, cat, check, clear, connect, download, free, grove. No. No, no. Text editor. Open up and edit one or more scripts. So maybe I should use Nano to read those letters. I don't see the way to check progress. At least didn't notice. Let's try Nano for reading. J0.msg. No, it doesn't work like that. Maybe this Vim You know I'm tired of writing this every time Doesn't work Oh, invalid type. So that's why he, he cannot do it. Oh, tail. Yeah, I remember now. Tail. What was the last thing we ran? Joe's guns. Didn't work. Probably write something wrong. Maybe you need to tell GS. Damn it. No script? Oh, I didn't start it, I think. Damn. What? That's why you always need to check progress. Run. Now it's working. Now we can tail it. Damn it. It will take a while for it to run and probably first one gonna be fail. I just want to see what will happen. Then we can leave. Yeah, wait, 50 seconds, that's a lot. Maybe we should look out failed hack, gained experience, yeah, whatever. So, city, maybe we should go somewhere else. If Jim is to increase strength and stuff, where could I buy computer things? Well, I will just go through everything, as I said. So now it's this. Delta 1, whatever it is. Delta 1, apply for the IT job, security job, software job. Okay, this is just job. Now we got our money. 7,000. Yeah, pretty neat.
11. Well, numbers just go weird now. There is no like 8 or anything. I mean, not 12 or just 94, 88, 35. University. Study computer science. Free! Please. <laughs> you are currently studying computer science. Total cost zero. Hacking experience one a second. Do something else simultaneously. Uh, probably. I, I bet it probably worsens if you're not focused. But whatever. Okay, we learned something. Slums? Karmical security. This is job. NSA. Job. Four Sigma. Job. Slums. Shoplift, rob store, mug, deal drugs. Oh, basically, this is a business, but underground business. <laughs> if you call it that. Uh, travel agency, I don't want that. Joe's Guns. Oh my god. Apply to be employee. Apply to be part time employee. Food and stuff. They probably do this because I am hacking them. Oh, excuse me. Blade Industries. Business. It is job. 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 Megacorp. Job. Hospital. Get treatment for wounds. Free. Yeah, that's probably if I try to mug people and they shove knife in, knife into me. Powerhouse gym. Strength. Defense. Dexterity. Agility. CIA. Job. Alpha Enterprise. Okay, what's this? I can apply for job. I can also purchase servers. You can order bigger servers via scripts. We don't take custom orders in person. Purchase Tor router. I wonder what it does. More RAM means more scripts on home. Upgrade home RAM 8GB to 16GB. Cost RAM. RAM. Core increase the eff effectiveness of growth and weaken on home. Upgrade home core from 1 to 2. 7 billion. Nice price. Well, so they say me that upgrading RAM is 1 million. It can't be 1000. So you probably need to divide all numbers by 10,000. Because 100 is a reasonable price. 1000 is not. I wonder what's the difference. This 8 gigabyte server or this 1 million. Because it seems like this is the right one. Because it says more RAM means more scripts on home, so this is exactly what for that. Server RAM is probably something else. Maybe I should not bother with that. I don't understand it yet. We have money, so why not run, run it? Now, why not buy it? 
So okay, I will I will do it. So that's cool. So now we have a lot of RAM. We can do whatever we want. So it was this. I need to remember this place. Message received from unknown sender. I've been watching you. Your skills are very impressive, but you're wasting your talents. If you join us, you can put your skills to good use and change the world for the better. If you join us, we can unlock your full potential. But first, you must pass our test. Find and install the backdoor on our server. CyberSec. This message was saved as CSEC test on your computer. Yeah, I, I, I would like to be able to access these messages. So CyberSec is simply CSEC test. Stock exchange. <laughs> Not gonna do that yet. It's a bit over my head. Anyways, I forgot everything. Those quests are going too fast. So now we have a lot of RAM, we could take one more. We have a noodles, food stuff, Sigma cosmetics, Joe's guns. We need something special for access this because root is not accessible. I don't know how to do that yet. Should we spend our money on this? Doesn't really matter. So it's about ten. Okay, now we have to think, maybe it's already better to use this. It's almost the same. Almost same price. Yeah. So now this is way better to upgrade. It's like four times. It's still like ten times better, but then this one is better. Maybe I should buy intense. <laughs> Oh, 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 what I'm doing? 37 or... Half million. Okay, I don't understand. It seems very good value. Looks like my main income gonna be this this shit. <sighs> that first message that I uh, they sent me milestones. They wanted me to do this flight XE. 
I would like to read that message once again. So let's check. Dark web. Oh, they could, there it is. Display a MSG elite or text file. Okay, cat. Cat. How the guy was called? F0? Nah. Damn it. Forget his name. No file at path. Is there a way to see all files? Maybe I should just write cat. No. Oh, there it is, ls. Ah, it was J, not F. Yeah, I see. Oh, but actually, I don't really need to use the hard command. I could just click on it. So, what this guy said... I know you can see it. Blah, blah, blah. Use this program to track your... The Flight X program was added to your computer. Use this program to track your progress. Well, it's kind of feel wrong to run some file somebody sent me, unknown person, but because this is the quest, I will do it. Well, we, 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 we just gonna run it and see what happens. Our computer breaks or no? Oh, it just says me. Hacking skills 85, augmentation 0. Money 2 million. 100 billion max. Hmm. Oh, now we can make something more. This program executes a brute force attack that opens SSH port. This seems a reasonable thing to buy because I wanted to hack one more shop. This one. Required hacking skill for hack and backdoor 30. Server. So we can't run nuke, I guess. Because we don't have access. I will try anyway. Oh, so I can. Well, I guess it works. Cancelled? Heck, did I did it? They have some kind of protection. No, it was me when I copied that name. Somehow cancelled it. Failed. Okay, it doesn't matter. Home. 
Mano. How many times I will copy it? Maybe you should learn myself. Hong. Ang. T. Hmm. I think I'm gonna end now. It's not very interesting for you, probably. I will read that tutorials of offline and then any changes I wanna do in the servers in the game, I will be recording. Even the smallest one. All I'm gonna do offline is just read. Or maybe we should do the first thing they wanted. Okay, I don't want to look at this. As long as I see that it's running, it's all fine. They wanted me to kill noodles, but why? You can go to the active script page keyboard shortcut and press kill script button. Okay. If you skip the introduction tutorial they ignore the part above instead go to hack nodes page keyboard short oh no, and purchase hack node to start generate passive income hack node okay they want me to buy hack node A minute. Oops. Go to Hacknet Nodes page. Alt H. Alt H. What the hell? Oh, this is that. Purchase Hacknet node. I think... Th oh, they teach me how to do this, but I already done it. Also, why they wanted me to kill my noodle? <laughs> my noodle. Kill my noodle hack. This is not connected. Very weird. How many of these? Creating your first script. Now, well, create a generic hacking script that can be used early in the game, or though the entire game if you want. Before we write the script, here are some things you want to familiarize yourself with. General hacking mechanics. Server security. Okay, let's see general hacking mechanics. You need to read a lot. But not a lot, a lot. <laughs> hacking. General hacking mechanics. When you execute a hack command, either manually through a terminal or automatically through a script, you attempt to hack the server. This action takes time. The more advanced server security is, the more time it will take. Your hacking skill level also affects 
the hacking time with a higher hacking skill leading to shorter hacking time. Also, running the hack command manually through terminal is faster than hacking from script. I have noticed that myself, actually. You attempt to hack a server will not always succeed. The ch chance you have to successfully hack the server is also determined by the server security and your hacking skill level. Even if your hacking attempt is unsuccessful, you will still gain experience points. When you successfully hack a server, you steal the certain percentage of a server's total money. This percentage is once again determined by the server's security and your hacking skill level. The amount of money on server is not limitless. So if you constantly hack server and deplete its money, then you will encounter diminishing returns in your hacking, since you are only hacking a certain percentage. You can increase the amount of money on server using a script and the grow function in NetScript. I don't know what NetScript is. Bro. NetScript function. Grow, host name, OPTS. What OPTS object? RAM cost 0 0.15. Argument. Host name string. OPTS optimal parameter for configuring function behavior properties. Threads number. Number of threads to use for this function must be less than or equal to number of threads the script is running with. What? Okay, I don't understand that. If true, the function can affect the stock market return the number by which the money of the server was multiplied for the grow. Okay, this I would like to implement it into my script already running. Increase the amount of money available on server. The time is taken to execute depends on your hacking level and target server security level. When grow completes, the money available on target server will be increased by the number of threads used and certain fixed percentage. The percentage is determined by the target server growth rate, which varies between servers and security levels. Generally higher level servers will higher grow rates. Like hack grow can be called on a server from any server. The grow command requires root access to the target server. But there is not required hacking level to run command. It also raises the security level of the target server by 0.004 per thread. Action time is calculated at the start. Effect is calculated at the end. Example, while true, await NS growth foodstuff. Also, you write here a name. So this thing is not like important. Yeah, it's op optional. I think. Well, it seems it is optional. They didn't even show that you need to put apprentices here. And S grow. I wonder what is hack grow. Oh, it's it's not together. Like hack, grow can be called on, on any server from any server. Okay, let's put the grow and we will call a day. So, let's go to my scripts. Active scripts. Noodles. Let's try with noodles. How to kill it? Will this kill it or will it delete everything? Well, we will need to try it once. Killing script. So I need to wait? Or what? Because it's like an ing. Like it's happening right now. 
I guess it's already killed. Weird choice of words. So now we go noodles and we add money. Also, you see, there is like a double call, semi call, and there is a single one. Very weird. Okay, let's try to run this now. But before I do it, I would actually need to see how much money they have. So they have 34,000. If I do them growth command, how much money they will have? Okay, their money increased a lot. Like maybe it's not good plan to run growth all the time on the background. Because it would just multiple, multiple, multiple. Yeah, maybe this is not a good idea. But I will do it anyway. Documentation. Oh, okay, that later. I want to do it because I want to see what will happen. It will be like a lesson. Because, as I see it, because growth increases the security level, it will increase it so much after a while that I just cannot hack it anymore anyway see what will happen it will be a lesson home run what the hell Ah, noodles. Okay, it's running. I'm gonna end my video now. When I come back, we will see will the noodle server gonna be too hard. And I have ruined everything. So yeah, thanks for watching and I see you later. Bye.